everybody, I'm Sean Hammond with PremierGuitar.com. We're at NAMM 2011, day one at the Dunlop booth. We're with Brian again. Brian, how's it going? It's going good. Thanks, Sean. How are you? So you've got some new accessories you guys are excited about for this year. Why don't you tell us about those? Well, first off, what we have here is the fancy Derek Truck signature slide. It's, uh, it's our blues model, which he uh, was using already. And he decided he wanted to come on board and just kind of be a poster boy for um, Dunlop Slides. And we were happy to have him. And uh, that guy's the king when it comes to slides. And you know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, we're really excited about this. Uh, he's got his fancy signature in there. Can you see it? Cool. Now you've also got uh, several new picks, right? We are the pick people. First off, I have to say I'm really, really excited about the Tortex uh, T3. Basically, it's the same Tortex material, same Tortex tone, same Tortex tactile feel, but it has a jazz tip on the end, which, um, yeah, it gives you a little more articulation. It gets you uh, around the strings a little bit better. I, I'm really in love with this pick, I have to be honest. Uh, I've been a Tortex player forever, and uh, this thing came along, and I'm so stoked. Next up. Uh, Jazz 3 2.0. It's black Oltex in the jazz shape, uh, molded, sculpted, same tip as the jazz. The black Oltex is uh, a material that is sounds a little bit different than the clear Oltex. The clear Oltex, I think, is a little more brighter. Something about the dye kind of takes a little bit of the top end off, so it's a little it's a little warmer. So it's a li in my ears, it sounds in between the Ultex Clear and the Tortex. But, you know, I'm a crazy person, what do I know? Uh, next up, also in the black uh, Ultex is the Papa Hetfield, James Hetfield signature pick. This, I believe, is the 1.14, is the one that he uses. It's sculpted, it's molded, and uh, it's got all these cool, cool graphics. Hetfield, Papa Hets, Black Fang. Big seller right now. People are loving this pick. Another T3. I told you I love this one. Uh, we also have Kirk Hammett's Jazz 3. Now, uh, Kirk used to use our regular Jazz 3s, and he would take, you know, some cutters and cut out this point because he feels that he can get a grip on it better. Uh, we did the green color because he's a big fan of classic Universal monster movies, you know, Creature of the Black Lagoon, Frankenstein, and this is the pick that he uses uh, on tour. And then... Last off, what we have here is our fantastic Max Grip. It's part of our signature nylon series, uh, Dunlop Picks. Nylon Picks have been around for a thousand years. Cavemen were using them. They, they built the pyramid with this pick, really. Um, but it has the gripping surface that is just fantastic. It doesn't take off your fingerprints, but you can hold on to the pick really well. But there's a new uh, tip to it. It's a, it's a little, it's not as pointy as the Jazz, but uh, in the higher gauges, the thicker gauges, we sculpted it down so it's a little pointier for the shred guys. They want that release, that quick release. Strummers, they want it rounder for the acoustic guitars and stuff. So we kind of changed the, the tip uh, in the range for those types of players. Normally, shredders gravitate to a thicker pick. So we, we try to make it for those guys that like to do that. Very cool. We, we as guitar players tend to obsess over a lot of other things that are, seem a lot bigger, but these tiny things do affect the detail, how you play, your attack, your your technique. I mean, you know it sounds like a subtle thing, but it makes a big difference. I mean, everybody's always trying to get that edge. They're trying to get to play better. It's kind of a competition. You got to get out there and kick someone's butt. You know what I mean? You need every trick in the book because these kids nowadays are getting good, good, good. Awesome. Thanks. Where can people go to find out more about these? They can go. Fancy that you said that. I like that. Uh, JimDunlop.com. We got a new uh, website that we just put up. It's got all kinds of fancy bells and whistles, and I hope you guys enjoy it. And uh, keep playing music. Thanks, Brian. I'm Sean Hammond, and you're watching PremierGuitar.com.